We turn now to the town of Pulaski, where a new business is brewing some excitement for the community. WFXR's Kelsey John Baptiste caught up with the owner to hear about his big goals for this new venue. A new brewery is on tap to be the first in the town of Pulaski and could be open as early as next spring. When I moved here, um, I knew I wanted to open up a brewery, um, especially seeing how far behind this area of Virginia was in craft beer. After more than a decade in the brewing industry, Great Wilderness Brewing Company creator Scott Rockefeller says what attracted him to the town of Pulaski was its history. Looking at the the area and seeing Great Wilderness Road sparked me to create the name Great Wilderness Brewing Company. Rockefeller explains the building he will take over is from all the way back in 1910. His goal, more than 100 years later, turning it into a 30 by 20 foot outdoor space for live music and outdoor events. But Rockefeller says he's also looking for ways his brewery can create connections with the community and beyond especially military service members and veterans. I'm a United States Marine veteran, and um, I want to do a lot of veteran outreach for 22 a day and suicide awareness, but a lot of outreach within our community. Before that can happen, though, the old building needs a barrel's worth of work. Then we started the process, which has been a year and a half to two years in the making, of getting some state financial support to, first of all, evaluate the building um, and secondly to determine what renovations would be necessary in order to make it uh, a viable location for a brewery. As of last week, the town will receive $750,000 in industrial revitalization funds from the Virginia Department of Housing and Community Development, along with another grant to help with land remediation. I'm excited. I'm excited to, to get the opportunity to, to meet everybody in the community. Um, and I'm just excited to help make a difference in the, in the town. Rockefeller says he's hoping to open in the spring of 2024, offering up employment options for both full and part-time workers, and of course, quite a few cheers. In the town of Pulaski, Kelsey Jean-Baptiste, WFXR News.